Hey guys, Thea here. Just going to do a quick Canva tutorial of something that I watched somebody else do a tutorial of yesterday, Deanna, who's based in Sydney and is a fellow ambassador. And basically I'm going to find a, a photo and I have one in my recent ones right here. I'm just going to use this pink uh, background gal jumping, right? So I'm going to shrink it up a little bit and I'm going to make it quite a bit bigger actually, I think. And then I'm going to duplicate top Oops, undo, get the wrong one. I do that a lot actually. Uh, we're clicking on her, we're gonna hit duplicate this time and we're gonna remove the background. You need Canva Pro to be able to do this. So we're gonna remove the background of the woman in the pink room or whatever. Okay, so once that's done, just takes a second. Again, you need Canva Pro to be able to do this. Um, or you need to use a different tool like background remover and upload your background free picture. So now I, all I need to do is go to photos and I got this one here. All you would need to do is type in paper hole, but you need a specific kind of paper hole. Like some of these won't work because you actually need to have it be a cutout. See how I can see the pink in the background. So I might just shrink that down a little bit. I'm going to go position, center, and middle. Same with the pink one, position, center, and there it is in the middle. And I'm actually going to shrink him a little bit so we can't position, center, middle. There we go. Now we got it. That's about right. Cool. Now I just need to find her, right? I'm going to bring her to the front. So bringing her forward, I line her up. There we go. And then all I need to do is drag this up. And then of course we gonna drag the pink up because we don't want to see her little knees hanging out there. And bring that down and la voila, we have women jumping out of our paper room box, whatever you want to call it. I don't really know. But anyway, you can just stretch it. I grouped it all together. I'm just stretching it to make it a bit bigger. And that's about right, I think. I looks. I think it looks pretty good. What do you think? Let me know. Give it a try. You can also do things with, um, do it with similar things other than paper hole. You could type in, you know, broken glass. There's different things that you could do. You could have people popping out of a window, the same kind of effect. So give it a go and let me know how you get on. If you need any help, give me a shout. Thanks. I'm Thea. Say and see ya.